a 19-year-old man who stabbed a young dad to death at a house party has been convicted of murder. Shardon Carnegie stabbed Oliver Freckleton to his leg when the victim tried to break up a fight involving his friend. The wound cut two major blood vessels and he died on the driveway as he battled to protect his friend during the early hours of the morning. Now Carnegie faces life behind bars for murdering Mr Freckleton who died the day before his 20th birthday. Kate Seal, Specialist Prosecutor for the Crown Prosecution Service, said this is yet another senseless loss of young life to knife crime and I welcome the jury's verdicts of guilty. Oliver Freckleton should have been safe at his friend's house party and because of the defendant's actions, his life was tragically cut short as he selflessly tried to protect his friend. I seriously hope the verdicts serve as a warning to anyone who believes it is acceptable to carry knives and weapons. Oliver's family are devastated at their loss and my thoughts remain with them and his young daughter who will grow up without her father. Carnegie of Grampian Way, Derby was convicted by jurors of murder on March 21st. The verdict came following a two-month trial at Stratford Crown Court. Mikel Paddyfoot, 18 of Thackeray Street, Derby, and a 17-year-old girl who cannot be named for legal reasons were convicted of manslaughter. A fourth defendant, 21-year-old Travel Reed of Sinfin Lane, Derby, admitted manslaughter at the end of the trial. All the defendants will be sentenced at Stafford Crown Court on a date to be fixed. The court heard how Mr Freckleton went to a friend's 17th birthday party in Burton-on-Trent on December the 10th, 2021. The 17-year-old girl invited her boyfriend and his friends to the party for the sole purpose of attacking her ex-partner, who was friends with the victim. She had been unhappy her ex-partner was at the party, the CPS said. The defendants disguised themselves with masks and balaclavas before taking with them weapons including knives. The fight between the defendants and another of Mr Freckleton's friends started outside the house. The victim stepped in and was stabbed in the leg. He died on the driveway at the house party protecting his friend while the defendants drove away in three cars. Evidence from the witnesses revealed the 17 year old girl knew Carnegie carried a knife. The victim's blood was found on a foot mat in the rear of one of the getaway cars, while a pair of shorts stained with his blood were recovered from Carnegie. The defendant had attempted to evade justice by asking his dad to wash his clothing. A blood stained dress was also found at the girl's home. An investigation later found that the defendants had planned their attack, agreeing to take weapons during a conversation over social media. Detective Inspector Adrian Webb from Staffordshire Police's Major Investigation Department said this was a cowardly and senseless attack. It claimed the life of a much-loved young father, partner, son and friend. Oliver's murder continues to devastate his family and I express my deepest condolences to them. Whilst only Carnegie actually inflicted the fatal wound, those found guilty were to encourage or help in the violence. They would have realised the risk of some harm, some covered their faces, at least one carried a knife and another had a gun. Please like, share and comment and subscribe. Thank you.